recently? You had some doubts and he's validated the truth to you? You recognize his work in, the, in a time of disappointment? Been reminded of his resp your responsibility? The Holy Spirit's tugging at your heart? Jesus is tugging at your heart in that time of waywardness? Once you recognize it's the Lord, then things should change. And I hope they will. Let's stand. Our heads are bowed. Our eyes are closed. And I don't know what the Lord has spoken to your heart about this morning. I didn't want so much to apply specifically things to you in your own life. I wanted you to look at what God did in the lives of some other people. And let you decide in your own heart how that applies to you. So the question is, Do you see the Lord or do you not know that it's Him right now? Maybe it's been a while since you've talked to Him. Maybe it's been a while since you've been close. Maybe there's been a, some time that has transpired where you've had some doubts and some questions and some fears, some unbelief. Maybe there are some responsibilities you've let go. Maybe at home. Maybe at church. Maybe even on the job. You're not in a good place. I can't get you there, but I know who can. I can't, I can't, put, I can't confront anyone in this room who wouldn't do so. Would never think to. But I can tell you, if you'll let that wonderful Savior who stands as the gardener and stands on the shore because He loves you and all He's wanting is for you to get back into, back into the race, back into serving Him. If you'll let Him. He'll warm your heart by that fire, stir your soul, and you'll be able to say, as John, it's the Lord. Father, thank you for this morning. Lord, in whatever way you want to apply the message today, I pray that you would do some business with God in the hearts of your people. Jesus, we love you. and We, we, we thank you that you, you come to us in all these places and you love us and you're patient and you're kind but the ultimate purpose of it all is to establish that closeness with us again and to get us back serving you our heads are bowed our eyes are closed maybe this morning God spoke to your heart if he has just a moment, we're going to lift our eyes, and Doug's going to sing a song of invitation. You let the Lord have his way in your heart this morning. The altar's open.